Ivor was an entrepreneur. He graduated from the University of Washington, and with his new business degree, he opened one of Seattle's first aquariums. It was a dismal failure. So in August 1938, he moved it down here, and in the front of the aquarium, there was a little fish and chips and chowder stand. He was soon making more money off the fish and chips and chowder, so he sold the marine life, and he opened this restaurant, and this restaurant has been open since 1946 here on Pier 54. Ivor tried to keep himself in the press all the time. So the railroad train that dropped the corn syrup, he had his cook make up gigantic pancakes, and there's that famous picture of him ladling the corn syrup onto the pancakes. Of course, it was front page news in the Times and the PI. Two years ago, as we were planning our fall television and promotional campaign, we knew that people were gonna need to have some fun. So we knew that in 1953, he learned that the state ferry system found out it was easier to transport people in submarines. So that's when he went to the State Department of Natural Resources and said, I'd like to buy underwater space and we had heard rumors about these billboard locations, but nobody knew anything about them. So we hired a dive outfit from West Seattle, and in fact, they found the first billboard off Alki. So there's a long tradition here, starting with Ivor, to do quirky things involving the community. In January 1985, Ivor died, and his five senior lieutenants, they confronted the issue of who was going to replace Ivor as the public face and the spokesman for the company. They interviewed all the ad agencies in town, but the most interesting guy was Terry Heckler. One of the items that he proposed was the dancing clams. <laughs> In our clam shed upstairs, we have the eight clam shells, and we use them about 250 times a year in community parades, fundraisers, local auctions, places where we want to be tied to the neighborhoods. Those clams are out in the community all the time. We will continue to be locally owned. We will always have the highest quality product we will always strive to provide the best customer service we can, and we expect that we'll be in the community for another 72 years. Come on, home divers. Order up.